Let's familiarise ourselves with the ICOM IC9700 buttons and screen touch options. So of course to power on, press and hold here, power on. It's a slight delay. Okay, I've got version 1.44 firmware running here. It's on high power at the moment. So my node is running, so I've just turned this on. My node is in the room. I can literally just tap the screen and go frequency input. My node is on 434.300. Uh, Keep dirt going with the noughts, enter. Uh, we need to change band. So go on the B band here, press again. 434.300, keep going with the noughts, enter. Turn this up and you'll see my node come to life. And if we just go on the A band, tap the A band, see this frequency here. So I'm on my Icon 52, which is a beautiful radio as well. Anyway, watch this. Now this is why this is almost like two or even three radios in one. If I transmit now on the two meter just test, M0 FXB test, test, test. You can actually hear me. So it's simultaneous receive. And we've got someone talking. I'm, gonna, I'm on the A band and if I transmit, one, two, test, test, one, two. We can still hear the B band, so that's full duplex. And we're listening to Hubnet there and it sounds great. And my node, let me show you, is this tiny little box there, size of a cigarette packet. And I've got my hotspot up there, that's D-star, but my node is actually sending out an analog signal.